Hey guys, today we're having a look at Asus's uh, expert book. This is another range in the Asus, um, <laughs> or another product in the Asus range. But uh, yeah, um, the expert books are, I think, a bit more focused for business people um, in the office use kind of thing. Okay, so this is the B1500C. It's got a SSD. Um, it says, what do you call it, uh, PCI 3rd gen. Um, so the, I think the new SSDs are PCI gen, uh, gen 4. Uh, so PCIe is uh, the way the hard drive connects or the SSD connects to the uh, motherboard. And this is, a, this is, this is already high speed. Um, the gen 4s is just a, little, a, a lot higher. Um, this is an i5 11th gen and it's got Windows 10 Pro. Um, I think all of these machines come with 10 Pro because it's more focused um, for business. Um, I also see here that it says, um, <laughs> uh, where is it, HDD without HDD. So it, uh, I think that means that it's got a hard drive slot that doesn't, it's not populated. But I think this one we especially ordered with an extra, you know, drive. <clears throat> so let's open up the box. All right. Again, um, with these machines, you always greet it with a nice in search of incredible message on the box. Um, then your laptop is packaged in a little bag like this. Um, other stuff that's in the box is just the little booklets, uh, power supply, I think that's about it. So you've got this little brick, um, they all come with these little tiny bricks. This one is at least has got a, an adapter so it doesn't plug directly into, into the wall. And that is a bit better. Okay, and there's the power cord, power cord for the power brick. Let's have a look at the laptop itself. Um, put that there. Uh, this is the Asus Expert Book 11th Gen. Okay, so you've got your nice Asus or Asus logo there. This one is like a bluish color. Um, metallic, um, it's got a little bit of rubber feet. Okay, the IOs, you'll see there's the power port. Um, this is Type C port. It also says that it, uh, it can be powered through yet. I think that's what that little power sign means. Um, VGA port, which is very nice if you still use old projectors and stuff like that. HDMI and two USB ports. Um, I think these are both USB. Yeah, this is USB 3 ports and then on the other side, oh, at the back, you've got a bit of cooling action going on there. Um, on the other side, you've got your card reader, micro SD card reader, a uh, jack that will take your headset, um, like uh, the one that's got the microphone and the earphones. Um, there you've got a USB 2 port and also the just a LAN port, a uh, place where you can lock it also. Um, this one has got at the bottom, it's got nice, uh, you know, rubber feet. Uh, it is a bit high, so it might caught on some, uh, catch on something. Um, on the front, it's got these other ones. There's the little speaker holes. Uh, so what else? You can see the cooling through there. Oh, and on the on the <laughs> on the bottom, they've they've managed to into the plastic like mold or something the expert book logo. That's cool. Um, yeah, these little feet at the back is because if you open it up. Oh, and this machine opens up a little bit difficult. You'll have to take. Let's point the camera a bit down. You'll have to really get your fingers in there. Um, because the, there's magnets on um, each corner um, on the top and on the bottom there's magnets that keeps this 
the lid closed. Uh, well, it looks like you can open it up with one hand, but it's it's quite sticky. Um, yeah, so that's the Asus Expert Book. If you have a look from the side, you'll see what I mean with the with the feet. Um, when you it lifts up and it it's it stands on this back side of the screen. So the screen lifts up the laptop. It helps with cooling and it helps with a bit of um, just get the laptop uh, at a more ergonomically correct position for you to type. It's just a little bit, but it's it does help. Um, there you've also got the Asus Expert Book logo there. Um, at the top you've got a camera. Um, it's got a little privacy lens cover. So privacy slide or whatever you want to call that. Um, and then on this, yeah, you've got a full keyboard with a numlock, everything. The function key is in the middle of the other key. So yeah, that's a that's the way the laptops, these notebooks are designed. Um, it's not very heavy. I can I can easily hold it with one hand. Um, yeah, you can also see it's got that Intel Iris new technology and whatever. Um, the touchpad, uh, nice big touchpad. So these machines normally don't switch on out of the box. No, it does not. So let's have a look. Uh, oh, it does. So this one has already been charged. Uh, that's not standard out of the box. So I guess the guys who installed the SSD um, already, you know, charged it to make sure maybe that it works. I don't know. Um, yeah, I've got this. It's got a it's got a matte screen. You can see that because my lights. Um, not reflecting on it like you know seriously uh, glaring back at you um, and this is this is not the ideal <laughs> light for this you know unboxing but uh, this is what I've got for now um, yeah you can see that the machine is uh, is well built um, light for traveling and moving around um, I believe quick and you know nice to work with uh, hopefully that's that's giving you a bit of an idea of how the machine is um, I don't know if I will play sound on it for you guys maybe let's see okay so this is the machine's volume max volume like in, I'm turning it up all the way that's not very loud but I'll just show you something if you have this machine, um, Asus has got something like a, listen to this, if I put it on movie, this thing has got insane sound. And game, custom audio, you could put it on wide or in front. I don't know why music is so soft. If the music EQ is maybe not right. Let's check it out. Uh, it doesn't make a difference. Something weird with the EQ of the music thing. But in any case, it's got this DTS thing installed. So I think that's why it's just sounding a bit soft. I mean, total difference. <laughs> In any case, that's the sound of the of this laptop. It doesn't have a backlit keyboard, by the way. Okay, so another thing that's cool of this machine is it's got a little light here on your caps lock, so you can physically see when the caps lock is engaged or not. It's also got a function lock so you can change the F buttons to locked or not. Um, so if you press the function button and escape that also has got a little light so you can see now that the function button is now locked or not. Um, but uh, yeah that's the, the Asus Expert Book i5 11th Gen unboxed. <laughs> Thanks for watching.